Max up in the slot. He gets maxed up one on one on Bradley Roby. And Roby, there are not many guys who can run with this guy. And Roby cannot. And that ball was perfect. And just, again, another drop by the Chiefs receiver. Third down and 10 as a result. Mahomes is in trouble. Sweat got there. The pass is thrown to the sideline. Eagles are looking for a flag, and the officials will get together. That ball did not make it back to the line of scrimmage. Well, there was, there, in addition to that, there was nobody in the area, and they're going to throw the flag for grounding. I'm saying if they didn't get the Eagles fans, we're going to be going crazy. Offense number 15. Although he's outside the pocket, the ball did not make it back to the line of scrimmage. The ball replaced that spot of the foul. Lost it out. And now it's fourth down and forever. Josh Sweat got there and had Mahomes in his arms. And Patrick could not get the ball back to the line of scrimmage with this effort. There will be no two-second runoff as the offense has elected to use their large prior timeout. So they're out of timeouts. Would have been a 10-second runoff. See the line of scrimmage is at the 49, and this ball is well short of it. Meanwhile, for Marquez Valdez-Scantling, he's got great speed. Drops have been a problem. He's got an NFL high six drops on targets of 30 or more yards downfield. No other player has four. And as you said, I mean, Patrick Mahomes could not have laid that out there any better. Oh, my gosh. I mean, you, you just hope that you get an opportunity like that at any point in the ball game. And here it is at this critical moment with a chance to take the lead if you make that catch here at the end of the ball game and just unable to secure it. Chiefs need to get to the Philadelphia 41 for a first down, and now the Eagles will take a timeout. It's fourth and 25. With a minute 35 to go in Kansas City, out of timeouts, facing this schedule coming up at Las Vegas, at Green Bay, at home, against Buffalo, at New England, on Monday Night Football, Week 15, and the Raiders again, Bengals, and at the Chargers. Yeah, I think here on fourth down, Joe, we see this defense. They're all lined up back there. They're going to rush four guys and play coverage and try to protect the first down. You see them all. But you've got to get to Mahomes. I mean, he can put a ball just about anywhere on the field and try to cover him up. This, this is not easy. Airs it out. Downfield incomplete. And the Eagles take over. And they're going to ride out of here with a victory. Watson was the target yet again. And Nick Sirianni's Eagles have come in here at 8-1 and one and will leave at 9-1. and one. Well, Watson, I mean, I, I want to see a closer look because I don't know if he, if the ball got touched or not. It looked like it was a drop. It was a drop. If he catches that, that's a first down. I mean, Justin Watson is able to go down the field and hook up. You see the yellow line. Watson turns around at the top of the screen, and if he catches this ball, it's a first down. And, and Mahomes, that's what I'm saying, it, it, against a lot of quarterbacks, you can take that fourth and long for granted. Not with Mahomes, and that was the one that <laughs> should have been converted. A league-high 26 drops for this Kansas City Chiefs offense. And with opportunity on that deep shot to Valdez Scantling, and even on that fourth and 25, the Eagles are going to walk out of here with a four-point win. Everybody's been talking about the Super Bowl rematch. Is it a Super Bowl preview? It may very well be. There's no trophy handed out here tonight. But Jason Kelsey and the Philadelphia Eagles are going to get a road win here in Kansas City. Well, the Chiefs are going to go home tonight, and they're going to look at a lot of lost opportunities in order to win this game, especially on this last possession. We have to give credit to this Eagles team, and for the receiver.
resiliency that they showed in this second half, particularly the defense being able to make key stops and pitch a shutout while their offense struggled, and then the offense was able to make enough plays when they had to, and they showed why they were the NFC champs last year. Jalen Hurts with two touchdown runs in the game, and the Eagles pick up on what Troy was saying, shut out Kansas City in the second half. And Nick Sirianni gets the win over Andy Reid, who loses for the first time against his former organization. And big brother Jason Kelsey gets his first win over little brother Travis Kelsey in their NFL careers. Well, there are a lot of NFC teams back home watching this one tonight. San Francisco, Detroit, Dallas. First half, they were feeling pretty good about the chance of the Eagles maybe having their second loss, but what a great win for Philadelphia on the road against the Kansas City Chiefs. A moment for the Kelsey brothers, and we'll go down to Lisa Salters. Lisa. Thank you, Joe. Jalen, so much hype.